Hello, 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 waiting to go live. Are we live yet? Let's see, is it working? Hello, anybody there? Someone typed something, so I know it's working. Mm, yeah, I think. Yes, hello, good morning. Okay. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, and good night, wherever you are, whatever time it is. I'm doing another live stream today. So, we're kind of at the stage where, like, by the way, sorry for no video last night. I finished at like midnight last night and I sat in bed, like, ready to edit and just fell asleep. It was too much. But I'll show you all yesterday's progress tonight for definite. But what I have done is I've got all the beams cut for the floor. I've just got about like 14 noggins to do, which I know you'll enjoy. That's why we're doing this live stream. Um, and then Nick and Cameron are going to help me get all the wood, all the beams up to the very top of the chateau. We're going to winch them all up and then that's ready to be laid to so use them kind of while I'm here. So I'm going to cut these noggins now. Once I've done that, I'll give Nick and Cameron a shout. Welcome back, everyone. Thanks, everyone that's been watching them regularly as well. So, yeah, noggins, live noggins. God, I treat you lot to some stuff, don't I? Live noggins. Okay, it might be a bit noisy. Is there any problem? <clears throat> um, so, obviously, I'm sure you're all aware by now, because I'm doing it through the beams, uh, like in the metal beams, I mean, not into the wall. All the noggins can be the same size. That's why I've got this stop here. So I don't have to measure each one. I just push up, cut, push up, cut. Always let me. to get an extraction set up um actually i can't remember if i've said before but once a roof goes on that section um the workshop the whole workshop is going to move in there under the dry so it's going to be a lot bigger and they can set it up like a lot more permanently um which is going to be amazing and get hopefully get some new machines and do some proper kind of woodworking
Right, that is all the noggins cut. You're actually sat on a big pile of noggins as well. So it's 42 noggins and 15 beams all to go up now. Hopefully, because the winter is super strong, we can just pack a, like a load of them together. Let me call the let me call them others. We're ready for you on stage. There's enough hair and makeup. Right, I need to move you back. I think. I'm just going to go run and get the remote control for the winch. Isn't that what's hanging down from the top? That's the hand control. Well, if you were up there, yeah, you could there, do the hand well. control. Okay. Find it. Let's everyone see. <laughs> you lot, funny. Yeah, I got it. Right, connect these together somehow. And start bringing the beams in. I said to you five minutes ago. 
Yeah. We don't need your help with the noggins. Um, so we're going to start lifting these up now you kind of see me and nick from down below um, and then i'm going to take you all up to the roof uh, where we'll unload all the wood and get it laid out ready to lay the floor so which is going to be quite cool kind of seeing it all live and you get to see you know i know you see it on the vlog but maybe it's different in person let me just wipe your eyes Beautiful. <laughs> Something wrong with the sound. Cameron, have you got sound up there? Can you see? Yeah. Yeah, I'm talking in the chat right now. Can you hear what we're saying? Someone's saying sounds a bit dodgy. Is it dodgy for you? I've got about a five second delay. But you can hear everything we're saying. Okay, sound is fine. Okay, maybe because it's a live stream, if you haven't got good internet connection, you're, the way you view the video will be a bit sketchy. Ooh. You have to move that ladder, Cameron. You need to invest in some sort of basket, don't we? Create stuff like that up. Uh, I'm thinking even one of them netting, you know, like a trailer netting for all yeah. four corners. How far up? You have to lay it down at the same time as you're pulling it in. Oh, yeah. you're at a very acute angle. Don't shake it too much. I don't know. Yeah, you'd have to move that ladder to the beams. Right, you know, yeah, it's a little bit, you don't have to walk. He's got one like these, you can take it past and down. Got a layer, oh no, you wait for that to come down. Yeah, no. okay, carry on bringing these through. 
we did a bit of time was you've got to try one to say you're going to get them in there because it's going to have to go up and then up. Whereas onto this floor, it can go up, down. Yes. You're only going to have like two meters of winch to play with. So, the, yeah. I'm either going to have to swing it so they go up flat, two straps. No, I think. No, no, if we swing it kind of here, then it'll go up pretty vertical, but we can take the top end. That's what I'm saying, it's going to have to go top end in because you yeah. can't do anything like that. Yeah, yeah. So, I think three will be fine. So I'm going to try to see what I'm Uh, yeah. Come on, my cameras. Do the strap, uh, strap back as well, please. Come a long way if you think about it that well actually the very first video when me and Calvin put this floor in here we we're just lifting one by one up a ladder on the scaffolding and then me lifting one beam at a time going up the ladder or with a little winch the, like the speed we're doing things at now is crazy it's all streamlined so much hopefully we can get even better than that as well Yeah. So this last of the noggins going up. Then we're gonna take the beams up. We're just gonna do a few like we're just gonna send like two up for the first one to make sure you know it just works all right. And then we'll do bigger packets and then we're going up to the roof. <laughs> How many people are watching? 2,700 people. Uh, yeah, a lot of people saying about sound. I think it's okay. I think it could be your internet connection. Or it could be because I'm hotspotting. Could be an issue as well. Okay, I'll leave my phone there. Okay. 
I'll come up there and help you when we send the beams up. Where is your green one? The green straw. Yeah. Uh, that's a lot of picture, man. Right? I'll get mine. I'll get mine. Why? There's another one there for a new yellow one. Then it's quite. Now I've got to work out how I can climb two ladders with a laptop and a camera. Put them in a bucket and send them up on the wind. I could do it. Yeah, put me in a bucket and send them up on the wind. Put me in a bucket and send them up on the wind. Okay, I'm going to go up and help camera with these beams. I'm going to bring you guys up with me. Just working out how I can get the laptop and the camera and me up two ladders without everything breaking. Um... I might be able to carry it. Let's see. Let's see if I can carry it. Let me try. Okay. The live stream ends because something's gone unplugged. <laughs> if I fall, keep the laptop open, yeah. Just bear with me while I get up to the roof. Come in. Oh, 
Hang on. Hang on, don't touch anything. Shall we grab the laptop? No, because it's plugged into the camera. Hang on. I'm just doing that in case of it. Okay. <sighs> we made it up. Right. Uh, Fort turn it one sec. Set up so we can see. <laughs> yes, I know we need stairs. <laughs> Yeah, it's a pretty popular one, I won't lie. Gandalf, Radagast, Wurzel, Gummidge and Catwee are all the ones I see the most. They're the top runners, are they? Yeah, I'm alright with them, to be fair. I've been called worst in my life. <laughs> Sorry, too far up, can't hear you. Over this IV mineral. Right. That was all right as it was actually. So I need to get the bottom over the lip. Me and you touching in, quite touching. I'm not drinking it. Yeah. Try it, obviously. We can all turn up together. Huh? We can all turn up together. Well, I mean, <laughs> I don't care as long as I can get them in. <laughs> I'm 
My phone might give you giving the sound signals because they can hear the echo. So I just put a comment on my sounds off. <laughs> <laughs> sound is going on and off. Oh, van. Hurts, van. Delivery. Yeah, uh, looks like a delivery. Hurts. Can That's you get that, Nick? Let me sure Nick's just gone out to get the delivery. Let me, it's kind of hard because the camera is connected to the laptop. It's really short lead. Giving the view out of this window so far. Uh, it's quite hard to see the planting scheme at the moment, um, but all the plants are in place and um, they just basically need to be composted and, and like healed in. There you go. Uh, got something delivered. We are waiting on a few cool, exciting things, but I'm not sure what they are. Okay, let's read what some of you guys are saying while you're here. No terrible tradey ra radio. Well, the thing, the annoying thing is with filming is that we can't really listen to music while we're working because um, it affects the copyright. So actually, we've never had music. Sometimes I wear earphones like you see from on my own, but we can't have music playing. But encourage us all to talk. Dog's absolutely loving it. You see her racing around. Okay, let's go back in. This is, by the way, the old features in it, other than the old system and new situation, which is quite funny. Okay, roof time. Yeah, look at that for a view. Absolutely amazing. Okay, where can I put you? Guys, somewhere like here. Yeah.
<coughs> don't know if there is a sound issue it's showing up on my camera some people have got sound some people haven't maybe try refreshing the page or go in and out or check that you've got good internet connection um yeah so the plan is i've got this last third or floor to go in and um, that's what we're bringing up now it's all cut all the nuggets are cut all the profiles are cut i've just got to drill this metal beam into the wall and then i can put all that in when that's on i'm gonna start building the roof structure now there's some repairs to the wall here still to do so I can only get so far with that structure before I need to address them, uh, before I put any weight on, on these areas. But what I'm hoping is I can build enough of the roof structure to get me some kind of like shade from the elements and the rain and put a tarp over the last bit so I can work. Because at the moment, doing line work or anything like that is so, so hard to do um, with the cold weather and the rain. So hopefully that will mitigate that a little bit. Uh, let's start laying them out. I think there's another. Uh, that's six up, that's about five that's up so far. Six, six, seven, yeah. Kill. I have one end for what we're doing, walking them in. Yeah. Yeah. No kids are getting your love. These are all numbered. I cut these a different way, actually, which you'll see in the vlog tonight. It sped up the whole process massively, but it does mean I've got a number of them and they've all got to go in a certain... Well, we've got to go in numerical order, obviously. No, I'm just not wanting to do this 16 times in a row. I don't trust these balls. Yeah. Might as well, might as well pack them on here. Yeah. I can get them over here. All in numbered order, so. Yes. Oh, 
I giving you the size of the roll? Size of that the numbers? <laughs> Damn it. What are we? 12, 10. It's this kind of stuff, this bit of the whole renovation, which really takes the time up. And, you know, like in the vlog, especially, you know, by the time I edit a lot of this out, it seems like I haven't really done much. But it takes the best part of the day just getting everything like set up and prepped, getting the scaffolding ready, you know, getting everything where I need it to be to then start the work it is a massive mission. Obviously, that'll help slightly more when we get the stairs, but this place is just so big. It's crazy big. Uh, what we're we on now? One, two, three. We're on the fourth floor now. Yeah. Obviously, we've got all the roof wood to come up here. That's actually a lot heavier because that's structural grade Douglas fir. This is just pine. Um, so the roof stuff is a lot heavier. So hopefully I can cut it very roughly to size, bring it all up here and then do the final cuts and kind of work from this level. Why am I getting a really bad feeling that I won't be down there? Why? Just get them in the other side. Uh, I don't know if we can put them in yet. I've got to paint that beam. Mm. And they got to drill the hole. Although I did think... Maybe if we get away with painting it, put them in and drill, just miss a noggin out where the holes are going. Yeah. Just to kind of get this in, you know. I mean, the thing is, if, as long as we get at least one in, we can then use that to step yeah. that side to get the others in. What do you say? Step and go. You don't speak fluent Nick like I do just yet. Not many people speak fluent Nick. No. <laughs> about 300,000 people that have never understood the word he says. Basically a logging factory, this chateau. Nothing's coming out of my ear rolls. Sounds like he's dying.
The what, sorry? Do you want to come get the other end of this and we'll carry him in? Okay, that's all the wood up for that little bit of floor. And actually, I'm thinking I could probably tackle that today and just leave the spaces where I'm going to drill and then drill drill them tonight. Just going to paint the beam, put the wood in. You'll see it all on tonight's vlog, and you'll see kind of yesterday's. I don't know how I'm going to work it, whether I'll put them together or do separate ones. Um, God, we're going, wow, 48 minutes for... Four and a half thousand people. So thank you everyone for watching the live. We're going to crack on with this. The planting's not far off now. Uh, got a couple more pockets then down by the car park and by the gate. Yeah. Well, we'll be done by Friday with the planting anyway. Yeah, definitely. So I'll show, I'll show you Friday kind of how that's turned out. Um, yeah. And hopefully, yeah, that'll be done. And the garden will be done by Friday. And I'll see you all tonight or in the morning, or whatever time you're watching. Bye.